Hey everybody, it's me back again. Um, today we're going to be uh, doing another trading video on Roblox. So, um, if you guys hear some background noise, it's it's echoes. I'm uh, I'm away from my house, so um, yeah, that's that's why. Anyway, so let's get on with the first trade from Dragon Tail Ten, the perfectly legitimate fedora and the pumpkin headphones. So. Um, for this video, I'm going to be using I'll pull this out um, a certain Rob God, no. a certain Roblox uh, website, and it's uh, I can't really pronounce this, but it's this, and we're gonna be checking the values on here. Uh, I'll leave this in the description below if you guys really want to use it. It's pretty good, and it's just like a temporary use for RBX Rocks since that's taken down. Anyway. Um, so perfectly legitimate for door and pumpkin pie headphones for red dragon face, neon bombastic animal hoodie, and a shaggy. So first of all, um, perfectly legitimate business fedora. All right, so this is the perfectly legitimate business fedora. The demand is normal. It's va values five thousand, and um, yeah. So um, uh, let's see what else is on here. Um, the pumpkin pie headphones, that's of course low demand, it's a pretty small item. And red dragon face. So I think I might see something good for this. One second. Nope, terrible value. Uh, it's not valued. Uh, it has like a few sellers. This is like a terrible item. It's only had like a few spikes every now and then. It's only had three recently. And, um, yeah, so, uh, uh, it's looking pretty bad. So the neon bombastic hoodie, I'm gonna go look that up. I am actually kind of surprised. I thought that this was going to have some value, but apparently it doesn't. So it doesn't look like that this is a very demanded item. Um, but it, I'm pretty sure it used to be. It was a very demanded item back in like 2016. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to be looking it up anytime soon, but yeah, I'm pretty, I, I used to see these all, all, all around like every single game. So, um... And of course, the shaggy's like either normal or low demand, so let's just look that up. Um, yep, not valued. All right, because it's a small uh, decline. Sorry, buddy. All right, next up is the perfectly legitimate fedora and the pumpkin pie headphones for the Sarling hat and green starry night. All right, this is actually a pretty old item. It was created in 2012, but anyway. Um, yeah, this thing is, uh, not valued. I'm actually kind of surprised because I do see a lot of people, uh, using this in game and stuff. So, um, yeah. And then, like, the green Starry Night, pretty much all the uh, Starry Nights, um, god, Starry, Starry, Green Starry Night, yeah, pretty much all the, like, Starry Nights are not valued and are pretty bad. So, um, yep. That is going to be a decline. Again, the exact same thing. And we're actually losing 600 value if we were to accept this. So, um, we have the Golden Bling Braces and the Pandakin. Now, um, I'm pretty sure that this is not going to be in big demand because I'm pretty sure this released 2017. And, uh, yeah, so I'm going to go check that right now. Oh my god, this actually has demand. Alright. So this um it has a normal demand, it's not valued, and it's trend stabled. Uh, I never really see anybody wearing this, so I don't really know why it's demanded. Um so yeah, that that doesn't look like uh something I would really want because it looks like it's gonna fall soon. So um and of course the panda kit um is again a small item, so yeah, it's not valued. Uh decline. Alright, we're gonna go to the next trade. Alright, uh, this one actually kind of looks good if I was to, um, actually do this. So, pumpkin pie headphones and the perfectly legitimate for a green ultimate dragon Delu deluxe ninja sword pack. So we got actually both of these and, uh, the shaggy. Um, so I'm pretty sure all of these, like the shaggy the and the faces, are, um, pretty low demand. But I'm actually kind of curious to see the deluxe ninja because I'm pretty sure... That is a high demand item since a a, Ro a certain Roblox YouTuber has one of these. I am actually blown away. I don't know how this is not valued, um, because uh, Oblivious HD actually owns this, and I thought that a lot of people would get this. And you know, it, there is a lot of people who have this. It's like seven thousand, almost eighty thousand owners, and 
Uh, yeah, so this is apparently not valued. I'm actually pretty surprised, but, um, yeah, of course, it's not worth it, so decline the trade. Uh, alright, I think I know that. Ooh, the Deluxe Gaming Headset. Alright, this is, of course, a stabled one. I'm pretty sure Blue Goof is, too. Um, so we already know those. Um, so let's look up the Deluxe Gaming Headset. You're joking, right? The Deluxe Gaming Headset is, like, not valued? Dude, I'm actually kind of surprised. About it. I'm actually pretty surprised because, like, a lot of in the first few trading videos, people were really wanting this, so I thought it was in high demand. Like, all right, I mean, this is apparently terrible demand. All right, let's look up what next. Um, so the blue goof. I'm actually pretty sure that um, blue goof and um, I don't know. I actually thought that this was good. Yeah, these. For some reason, a lot of these items that people are training me, besides like that bling thing, they're low demand. I don't know why. And of course, the stereotype's low demand. Uh, I actually think I want to counter this. Um. Oh no, never mind. <laughs> All right, decline request. All right, guys. Before we end off this video, I kind of want to show something. You know, just to you know make this video. A little trade bit declined. longer. I got it. I declined my trade. Um, just so, uh, you know, add that little extra part in. So, if I was to look in my completed trades, I would go all the way down, and my first trade ever was with Chaletsky. Oh, my God. And this was a terrible trade. Even then, it was. This was back in uh, the 10th of 2016. So, um, yeah, this was the first trade I've ever done on my account. Of course, I did trade on other accounts, but, like, this is, I, I'm just, like, surprised that I even accepted this. I'm like, <laughs> oh, God, this is so stupid. But anyway, I, uh, I gave him a putrid green head in a jar for a crazy pot. And I got uh, a crazy pot back. And I'm, like, I'm still kind of pissed about it. Just because, of, like, this was, like, 100 Robux at first. And I bought it because I thought it looked cool. And I didn't really know how to trade back then. I just traded it on other accounts because I thought it sounded cool. So, uh, yeah. Alright, this other trade was um, with uh, this guy, and he's terminated now. And I'll, uh, the, yeah, he's turned. So, uh, God, get this out of here. Alright, anyway. Um, yeah, he's terminated. And uh, it's because I reported him like 15 times because I was so mad at this guy. So basically, um, he told me that he would give me. He, so he had this like, uh, I'll show it to you guys one second. So he said that he would give me this, and if I gave him all of these, and he said he would give it to me in another trade. So um, yeah. So super fly cap at the time, I think it was like at eight thousand or something, and I thought it looked really cool. So I'm like, I trusted him, and uh, yeah. So um. There were all my limiteds. These were my favorite items, and he asked for these two. I'm like, oh, God, all right, I might get this back. So I did it. All right, there, I'm going to show you guys one more trade. This was with my little brother, and I told him that I would, that, like, the 25 Robux, and I gave him these Pi headphones, and, like, I, I told him that it was going to be worth it, and then he did it with me. And then, like, it was terrible at the time for him, but, you know, he didn't know much about trading, so I thought that I could, you know, get the St. Patrick's uh, 2012 hat from him. It's It was, like, it was, like, what, like, 100 value higher. Anyway, yeah. So that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.